Hello everyone, Shadow TSF here, and um, today um, back on Warframe with Redemption 15. Um, today I'm doing this on my own today, and today I shall be explaining to you how to get um, Gauss for those that still do not know um, how to get him. So for Gauss, pretty much you must unlock the. My control expands to a new sector. Except you lack the capacity to stop me. Resolve to surrender or die. We. Shall speak again. Is there a button for the liches? But um, anyway, um, so as I was gonna, so as I was gonna say before I got interrupted by a mic with lich, um, in order to get Gauss, you must unlock Sedna, which you gotta unlock the star chart, every single planet, and then get to all the way to Sedna, to Pluto or the void, well, mostly Pluto. But um, today I shall be doing alone um, and showing you how to get um, Gauss. So the mission that you need to go for getting Gauss is Kelpie on set now. And, I, and it's a disruption mission. The main goal of it is um, keeping all four um, defensive alive. And you must kill the target that's um, beeping and glowing and um, coming towards the, um, the defensive thing that you're protecting. If you protect all four of them pretty much like for a bunch of rounds, there's a chance you might get a gauss bar pretty much if or either his weapon pretty much the Acarius or um his Aceltra. So yeah. Now for my weapons I'm using the Kuba Shakur. It's from Put the key in and you can pull the shinies out. Trick is, you got to wait to open. Something happens to the conjure before you can pull the goods. You don't get the goods. Ever. Also, the bleeders Allard sold the tech to will try to kill you. So many. <laughs> so we can get this thing started. Alright, so as I was saying, um, I brought my Kuba Nukor, which is a gun that will attack all the enemies around the target that you're shooting hit him with. I brought my Strofa um, gun blade, which is my melee. And I brought my um, my musket rough rifle, um, the Kuba Shakur. And for the Warframe, I shall be using my Nova, Nova Prime. But with the um, with the core press um can um thanks to a speedy cat. Anyway, let's go. Oh, and the reason I have like a pinkish um red energy, I tried making the energy look like a cherry blossom. So yeah. with interference routines specifically designed for the Tenno. Things might get a little weird. Conduit keys are carried by high-ranking muckety mucks. Knock them down. See what they've got. Basically, when you uh, so basically when you kill a certain amount of enemies, some enemies will drop a key pretty much depending on the color showing under your map on the top left. Those keys you're gonna be able to put them down, and then you're supposed to locate the target that's coming to destroy. And every circuit pretty much that um, 
that you get pretty much, they're all gonna be um different. Oh well, it's talking. They change the color of the background he comes in. Okay, cool. Be attacked by two. Okay, that was weird for a bomb. Anyway, so for now, I'll have my microphone muted and um, I'll just be like showing you guys what to do during the entire thing. And there's multiple rounds you can do, pretty much, you can do a lot of them. As long as you're able to hand over them pretty much with the right gear, the right level, um, or not level, um, the right equipment with the mods pretty much. Yeah, I forgot to mention, the drop you don't get them instantly for God's parts. You have to keep going pretty much or either repeat the mission pretty much many times until you get one of the parts pretty much. The drops are random, they can either give you the weapons, the blueprint for Gauss, um, the parts for him, or um, relics. So yeah, keep that in mind. That not all the time you'll be lucky during every round.
can't do anything about that last interference routine. You'll just have to wear it. Maybe I can catch the next one. It's on its way. I'll be doing 4 rounds of this one pretty much, if I don't get any post for gas break marks that will be the end of the video. But this was to sh explain and show you um, how to get gas pretty much and what to do during it. You can either play this with a team pretty much that know what they're doing or um, you can um, find out about builds pretty much and stuff like that that will benefit during this. A good damage for elemental for that will come from this will be heat damage along with corrosive. Or viral pretty much um with um radiation or something like that pretty much could also work. So yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
and you can kiss a conduit goodbye. We should have strike now. We got a few relics, but it's not as bad, honestly. But anyway, um, everyone, this shall be the end of the video. Um, I am your host, Shadow TSF, and yeah, if you guys want more Redemption 15, leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe for more Warframe. And we're um, and we're also trying to um, record other gameplay besides Warframe right now as well as long as we're trying. Sometimes you'll see our recording brief, but sometimes it's because we're busy in real, real life. So yeah. But anyway, if you guys want more than 15 playing some Warframe and giving you guys like these pretty much to help out like new players of you or people that didn't or some of you players that didn't know what to do in Warframe, leave a like, leave a comment, and even subscribe to Redemption 15 if you guys want to see more of these videos. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Have a, have a great day, be safe, and peace out everyone.